Welcome back to the Star Spawn. I'm Captain Maleko. And this is you two. And we are reviewing Blood Omen, Legacy of Cain. This is part two. Let's get it going. Yep. All right. And we're in the pause. Yes, the loading screen. All right, here we go. Wow, that music just kicks in, doesn't it? Holy crap. Yeah, it does. It's just, bam! It's just bam. Alright. Not sure if it restarts every time you pause or not. So I noticed that it's really hard to see this, the objects on the screen. Like when you zoomed out, when you have to play in zoomed out mode, but. Most of the time, all these objects are really hard to see, and it's hard to distinguish what they are. Well, you got black on black, which, you know, I guess... Yeah. And that's a door right there. Yeah. It's impossible to see. <laughs> and in the night again. Just do a victory lap over the mausoleum. At least it stopped raining. Yeah. You know, I was thinking about that last time we were, we were playing this. You know, in Twilight, it rains all the freaking time in Washington. Do those guys have to stay inside? Are, are vampires really allergic to water? I don't think they are. I think this is made up in this game. Oh, this, 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 just this poor douchebag. He has to worry this, this about guy. it. <laughs> Later on, it, it becomes moot anyway. It stops raining. Hunger and weakness are no bar to vengeance's call. I would find my slayers and send them who, back. Who just talks like that out randomly? <laughs> I am monologuing. I don't know, maybe he's in a Shakespearean play. Richard III. Yeah, it's those guys again, the men in tights. We're men. We're men in tights. Tight, tights. Epic double kill there. Oh! oh. <laughs> Combo! <laughs> Oh crap, man, you better run, dude. They're everywhere. What? I know, They're right? coming out of the woodworks. <laughs> Their sneering faces were forever etched upon my memory. I had crossed death for this moment. My mind was empty save for one thought. I would kill. There is no greater relief than that from vengeance sated. With my assassins dead, my quest All right. is over. Oh. Well, you know, when I'm out killing a whole bunch of men in tights, I always kind of monologue in my head about me slaying them down. <laughs> Tis not over, Cain. These fools were merely the instruments of your murder, not the cause. Look to their masters. Look to the pillars. And gain way to the fortress of the mind. Good, good. Let the hate flow. <laughs> you gotta, you gotta admire the lot of work they put into that frame. Took place. <laughs> There's like one vowel in that. I know, this is gibberish. <laughs> this guy is he's, he's a pirate. He's getting a lot done. It, by the way, it loads every single time you enter a house, oh, yeah. and every single time you leave a house. So yeah, the, the common people are just attacking you for no reason. Oh! And we're back. Take that, bitch. We're back at the beginning. I ain't got time for you, stranger. And get out of me, boy. He's still pacing. What the hell does that guy do? <laughs> <laughs> no. Okay, so I'm getting a weird Castlevania vibe here. Are we gonna experience some sort of curse and it's gonna turn daytime? <laughs> what a horrible night to have a curse. And then it turns light and you turn into dust. <laughs> so, that's the entire Blood Omen game. When it turns day, it's over. It looks like it's a day right now. And you're just walking about. He's on a walkabout. Walk Crikey. About. So I didn't know uh, that you could break these barrels, but apparently you can. 
And there's always stuff in them. There's always stuff in Collector them. Collector cards! After this, we're gonna go play a game of Magic the Gathering. Vampire Edition. And this chick, she don't care. She's like, a guy come busting into her house, breaking her barrels, breaking her barrels. stealing her <laughs> shit. That's what I'm gonna do. Yeah, for some, for some reason, only the people in the taverns attack you. Everybody else is so fine with this someone busting in and looking all gray and red-eyed. They, uh... These people are serious about their beer. You know, by the, by the look of that sign, they're German, and Germans love their beer. <laughs> I'd be pissed off if some vampire busted in my pub so I'd take my shit. The necromancer and had offered me no warning as to what my resurrection would entail, and yet I must confess in my haste I had not sought one. Was his gift a curse? I would seek the pillars for an answer. The pillars. The pillars. Zeke Sterl. Okay, so Kane just kind of randomly screams out that. I don't know why. I don't even know what he's saying. Yeah. Sounds like, hey, Victor. Yay, Victor! Hey, Victor! God damn, does he do it a lot. I swear, <laughs> every single guy. <laughs> oh god! Lightning bolt! Lightning bolt! Lightning bolt! Lightning bolt! Those are <laughs> lightning bolt! Those are daggers. He's daggers. Oh, it is. I'm sorry. I thought it was a larper throwing lightning bolt. <laughs> lightning bolt! Tell. Lightning bolt! <laughs> <laughs> oh god! He just threw the dagger right through me. The hit detection in this game is so bad. The people in this village are some of the ballsiest people I've ever seen in there. Look at that guy. Hey, He's... you guys! Hey, Victor! Hey, Victor! <laughs> he does that a lot, too. So, I don't get it. Is Robin Hood and his men, are they just hanging out there waiting for vampires to come strolling along through their woods? I guess, man. As daylight chases darkness, the vampire's power wanes. So apparently in the daytime, you just get a little bit weaker. The pillars of Nosgoth. Even in life, few sights have moved me such as this. I marvel that such beauty should grace our dying world. So those are those pillars that cracked in the beginning? They're a lot bigger now. Yeah! <laughs> I was gonna say they they weren't that big before. <laughs> <laughs> and of course on top of that pillar is, you know, Saruman yodeling. Look <laughs> <laughs> at that bright blue teleporter. It just doesn't fit at all. It's just there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, cutscene. Okay, so now at least we understand what the pillars are. Okay, they looked a lot bigger when he last looked. Oh God, Jesus! That's ugly. Keep your distance, or I'll send you back to hell, spirit. There is nothing left of me to fear, vampire. I'm only a shadow of my former self, Ari, the balance of the circle of nine. Even so, I can provide the answers you seek. I seek only a cure. There is no cure for death. Only release. Only life. We must destroy the sorcery. The sorcery that is now poisoning Nosgoth. Only then will you realize peace. So I'm assuming his, his chainmail is blood soaking. It's not really red. I don't know. Now these pillars have been corrupted by a traitor. My murder at the hands of this beast drove my love yeah. to man. She is a butterface. Now Good God. Misery <laughs> and pain among the oh God. Yeah. Crumbling no. the no, yeah. of Nosgoth. You must restore balance. You must right the pillars of Nosgoth. I care the one who for the fate of this world. world. Then for yourself, Cain. You got half skull face. Unspoken. Hi, I'm face bones. Two face. <laughs> <laughs> Bing. 
I mean, I guess that's the girl that got murdered in the beginning. I know, but... You know, tip the scales. Yeah, you stab her in the back and her face melts off? That is the dagger I want. Your raptor, with his <laughs> blind act of vengeance, threatened to destroy all of Nosgoth. Each circle member was bonded to the pillar he served. The pillars reflected the mental state of their servants, and as the minds of the circle degenerated and descended farther into dementia, the pillars crumbled. To restore them, each member of the circle had to die. Exposition, and the exposition. The had to be returned. Only when all the pillars were restored did Ariel claim my curse would end. And so, my hunt for Nupraptor began. <laughs> Nupraptor. Let's go hunt some Nupraptors. Aye. Mm. Mm. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm looking at this picture and I'm thinking of this guy's voice, and it just doesn't match up for me. Yeah, it just—it's not working. The heart of darkness. He reminds Flay. me of someone. I just can't think of it. Flay. 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 Flay of fish. Okay, so now that we uh, we talked to Ghost Lady, finally know what we're supposed to do. We're gonna go through this other warp portal. These conveniently placed warp portals. I know, right? For a civilization that seems to be in the you know medieval, medieval times, serve as landmarks during my They have some back serious forth. technologies. Once I have committed their locations to memory, I can always return. So yeah, this is the fast travel system. You get like a thing called a bat form, and you can fly to any of these places you activate. I can great I'm Batman. From my vantage in the heavens, no region of Nosgoth is forbidden to me. Except for these pillars. These are the only places I can fly to. So, you are the, what, the retarded cousin of Alucard? Is that what I'm getting at? Uh, yeah, Alucard, that's right. <laughs> it reminds me a lot of Alucard. He doesn't have the mist form, though. That was the best form in that game. Oh my god, how many times are we going to stop the music here? <laughs> Take that! <laughs> this game is so easy. I haven't gotten touched like once. Hey, look, it's a picture of me. Yeah, apparently they just painted all these pictures on the ground just for you. Sweet! I love being pictured. It uh, it usually signifies that that's what you're gonna get in this dungeon. So I guess it's kind of like a marker. More skeletons. More bloody skeletons. Bleed. More oh. Bloody skeletons. <laughs> uh, that scream. <laughs> okay, so I'm having serious problems with the skeletons. One, they're bleeding. Two, they're screaming. Both have required some form of organ. <laughs> Skeletons don't have. What the hell spike is that? Ball. That's a spike ball. <laughs> In the strip of the spike balls. While it is true that natural light weakens a vampire, magical light can have many uses indeed. 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 Horrible voice act. It's magic. And, uh, <laughs> Stranger. Light. So you're a light spell now. Yeah. Again, see, problem with this. You're a vampire. Aren't you not supposed to like light? Well, he just said that. I know. That magical light is. Is okay. It's not. Is okay. It's all. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. All right. So this concludes part two of Blood Omen. We will see you next time in part three. Part three!